All right, going through the loops, real nice and easy. Looking out for a potential dropping skyscraper. Uh... Oh! <laughs> Hello, YouTube. Komodo Gaming here, bringing you guys another episode of Brick Rigs, and today Bob is back, and he is ready to do some stunting. Yes, Bob the Stunt Man is back and the city has organized a new stunt festival. Uh, this thing is gonna be insane. We're gonna blow up some stuff. We're gonna do some stunts. We're gonna fly some creations. We're also gonna blow up some more stuff. Uh, Bob's probably gonna blow up several times in the process. Uh, overall, it's probably not gonna be pretty, but it doesn't matter. The city has uh, organized this to probably make the Bobs forget about the zombie apocalypse, which has been happening as of recent, but Bob saved the day, so we're all good to go there. So yeah, we're going to highlight a lot of very awesome stunt creations, uh, some awesome planes, and I've got some things planned out that I'm not quite sure if they're going to work, but they're going to be very, very awesome. So yeah, we're going to jump right into this. If you are enjoying Brick Rigs on the channel, maybe hit that thumbs up button. It helps out my channel, and let's do this. All right, so the stunts are ready to get underway. We have an awesome eagle here for the opening ceremony. Uh, this is made by Alpha Gyarados. Now, he's got a new name on the workshop, or his, he's got a new Steam name. It's called New Year, New Name. Uh, that's it. That's his name. So if you want to find any of these creations, uh, they're going to be there. And Oh, this looks so awesome. All right, so we have this big eagle. And this is the opening ceremony. We're going to drive in. We're going to fly through some loops, do some stunts for the bobs. And this is totally going to go good. All right, so let's go ahead. I'm assuming this works just like a jet. Uh, okay, come on, Eagle. Take off. Whoa, it just took right off. Oh, look at that. You got the American flag waving in the air. Oh, this is too awesome. Okay. Okay, camera's a little little wobbly. Hold on, let's go ahead and go to the other camera. Oh, that's because the Eagle wobbles. <laughs> okay. All right, let's make a pass. Uh, we're going to get a real nice low pass uh, in front of the bobs as soon as I figure out how to make this thing turn. Oh, boy. All right, the eagle is coming in for its first stunt pass here. Let's go one ring, two rings, uh, three rings. How did I do that on the first try? <laughs> okay, well, that went uh, better than expected. We're going to have to use bigger craft for that and faster craft. Uh, we're going to have to do one low pass. Uh-oh, uh-oh, no, no, oh, no, you guys didn't see that. Totally just did not happen. Hold on, hold on, let's reset the eagle. Uh, we still have to do a low pass over the bobs. Uh, I'm really surprised that the loop went that well. Uh, I think maybe I'm getting slightly better at piloting stuff in Brick Rigs. Or maybe I should say Bob's getting better. I mean, Bob's not perfect, though. Alright, so we're gonna go over low pass. Hey, I wonder if I can get through one of those loops on the stunt track. Oh, and here we go. Oh, wait, no, no, there's stuff in the way! Oh! Yeah! Opening ceremonies! Woo! Uh, that, that went well. Um, where did the, uh, where did the eagle go? Yeah, oh, oh, <laughs> why are the bobs on fire? <laughs> oh boy, oh boy, something uh, went horribly wrong, or, or I should say horribly right, because this is uh, the way normal Brick Riggs episodes go. Where's the eagle at? I don't see any pieces of the eagle, oh, never mind, that's a brown piece right there. Huh. All right, so we're ready for our first main event. We've got a awesome stunt course that is on fire right now, and I'm probably going to have to repair it real quick. But yeah, once we do that, we've got that, and we have an awesome stunt truck, and we are ready to begin with our first event. Man, this stunt show is hot. Uh, the bobs are still on fire over there. So yeah, we've got an awesome stunt course here. This is made by New Year, New Name. Same guy who made the Exploding Eagle. And yeah, this is the toughest stunt truck that I've ever played with on Brick Rigs. It does not break apart easily. So we gotta get in position here. I'm debating on what I wanna hit first. Uh, what do I have enough run up for? Uh, there's a big bump here, so it's gonna be kinda hard to run up on some of these ramps. There's a backflip ramp over there. Let's go ahead and hit it real quick. There we go. Let's go backflip. And. Oh! <laughs> Wait! Yes! Yes, first try! Why is it with first tries here? Like, why Why are we able to... Wait, what happened to the other group of bobs? Okay, never mind. Uh, we need to get more of a crowd going here. Our crowd is kind of falling apart. 
I don't know how I'm able to nail these stunts the first try. That is not a uh, normal form. What's happening to the loot back there? Okay. Well, I decided to fall over. All right. So we have other stunts here. Obviously, you got the backflip ramp, which he's a uh, he's done a fantastic job with that. I don't know how you achieve that shape in brick rigs, but huh, that's pretty cool. All right, so we've got a bomb jump. I kind of want to hit one of the big loot jumps. So let's go ahead and go around here. Uh, I think that's an explosive one. It kind of feels like we need more of a run up here because you get this little bump there. All right. Oh, we're not going fast enough at all. Hold on. Uh, let's go back, uh, and we're going to try this again. All right. So we need to get a little bit of run up to the explosive loop thingy, my bob. Let's go ahead and hit this, and let's go. Wait. No. How am I supposed to get enough speed here? Wait a minute. Okay, so it seems like the curve kind of pops you up. What if we were to stick two of these stunt courses together? That would totally work, I think. And then I'll be able to like run across and then hit the ramp and then hit the explosive loop. Yeah, that's gonna work. All right, so what's better than one stunt course? Two stunt courses. So I feel like we have enough run up now. There's a little bit of a gap, but let's see what happens here. No, it blows out the tires. Hey, hey, oh, oh, uh oh, 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 huh, that almost worked. All right, I feel like this is going to work when we stick these two thingies together and, uh-oh, uh-oh, am I stuck? All right, we're good. Look how close we are. We almost got it right on the, uh, right on the money right there. So let's try to stick these two courses uh, a little closer together and then I should have the run up uh, to complete the ramps here. You know, this is a lot harder than it seems to try to line these two courses up. Uh, I might have made a mistake here. Okay. Oh, that might be it there. All right, let's go and repair. Okay, that side's together. All right, let's go to the other side. And we're going to hit repair. <gasps> Did we do it? Are this close enough that I can have the big run-up that I need to get up the ramp? That looks pretty close. There's a little bit of a bump there. All right, so let's go ahead and hit this loop. This has been a lot of effort to hit this loop. Uh, let's go. Here we go. Stunt show, Bob, Tom, and oh, that's a pretty big gap. Here we go. No, no, it blew out the tires. No, <laughs> no, I can't do this. I can't do this, folks. I, I really can't. I can't get these two things close enough. Dang it. All right, uh, we gotta, we're going to give this one more try. Maybe the other side is a, a little safer. So, you know what? Bob's, uh, his little destructive tendencies are starting to kick in. He kind of wants to just blow this course up now. All right, here we go. Oh, that's a gap there. Come on, just get over the gap. Get over the gap. No! No, you know what? You know what? I, I got an idea. I got an idea for this course. It's a fantastic course. It needs a little bit more run-up. We're going to hop off this. I got something I need to grab. And uh, we're going we're gonna to move this course for the city. All right, so Mr. Magic Mushroom, we had a creation of his a uh, couple episodes ago. It was a city destroyer. And, well, he's created a new one, and, yeah, check this out. I don't know what's going to happen here. This thing is 7,000 bricks. We are ready to crash the game, so I really need to move those stunt courses. That way we can continue the stunt show, and I think this can do it. So let's go ahead and spawn this. This is going to take a bit. All right, so this thing is spawned. This thing looks really screwed up looking. I don't know what this... Are those rockets? Wait. Oh, dear. Oh, this is awesome. Okay, so what we're going to do... Let's get in position. I know the frame rate is probably just absolutely terrible right now, but we need to move this stunt course. That way we can continue the stunt show. So we're going to position this here. Uh, I'm assuming this just works uh, like the normal rocket creations. Oh, yes. All right. Let's go ahead and slow this down because this is going to be really bad once this starts. So let's go. Boom. Let's light it up. Oh, dear. Oh, uh-oh, what just happened? Wait, what just happened? Wait, what just happened? Uh-oh. Uh-oh. What does that mean? What, <laughs> what does that mean? Wow. Maybe I need to read the instructions again. What the heck? Um, you know, I could just set this in the middle of the stunt show, and this would be perfectly fine. This is like a firework, actually. That's a lot of pieces. All right, so I do believe I figured out how this works, I think. Uh, so this is like any other mobile rocket launcher. Uh, we're going to go ahead and release the bottoms first. Let's go ahead and slow down time. That way we can actually see what the heck's happening. And let's light those up. 
Alright, maximum devastation right now. Right here. There we go. Oh, don't hit the creation. Oh, what are you doing? What are you doing, rockets? What are you doing? Oh, they're like corn cobs. Uh oh, they're gonna run into each other. Uh oh. Uh oh. Come on, corn cobs! No! Oh, we're still gonna hit the stunt show. We're hitting it! We're hitting the stunt show! Oh, that's not quite as devastating as I want it to be. Maybe we need to be from an elevated position. Oh, actually, we're doing pretty good work here on the loops. That is just like, it's a reign of terror. Look at the debris field. Uh, it's heading to the city, actually. Uh-oh. Uh, hold uh, on. Uh, let's speed this up real quick. There we go. Perfectly fine, folks. Uh, is the city going to get affected here? No, we're good. City's fine. There's a couple little dings. Anybody in the office buildings are probably wondering what the heck is happening over there at the airfield, but... Uh, besides that, we're good. Alright, so we've got a couple more tries here. So, let's go... Let's just light the, both the tops real quick. Can I do both at the same time, or do I have to... Come on. Come on. No, no, don't do that. That's not what I wanted. It. Oh, that's not what I wanted. That's not what I wanted. Oh, no. Oh, this is gonna blow me up. No! Oh, dear. Oh, what the heck? Yeah, this is probably just better used as a bomb. Because Komodo cannot figure out how to exactly do this without blowing himself up. That is a glorious explosion, though. I will give it that. So, it's going to speed up. Hey! We hit the stunt course. You know what? I got an idea. Uh, we're just going to... This is going to be probably very bad once we do it. L little laggy. Let's just... Let's just drop it. What's the worst that can happen, right? Slow down time here. Let's go ahead and ignite those real quick. Alright, so we're just going to drop... When you can't use the tank or rocket launcher, just drop it on the creation. It's still going to have the same glorious effects. At least I hope it's going to. There we go. We're ready to blow this up. Yes! No! Oh. Wait, what? Those did not go off? What do you mean those didn't go off? What? Uh-oh. Oh. 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 Oh, they're going off now. Oh, no! Oh, no! Oh, no! I did not mean to do that! No! Bob! Uh, hold on. Bob just went down below the map. Oh. There's your grand finale for the, uh, the old stunt show. Uh, oh, oh. Yeah! Bob just leveled a part of it, and Bob fell through the, uh, through the map. Rip Bob. All right, well, I think it is, uh, ultimately, it's time for the next, uh, next event here. All right, so the next event is going to be the ultimate of rock crawling events. Uh, this is made by the same guy who's done all the stunt stuff, and this is a challenge. This is actually really cool looking. So you got to take one of his little old rock crawlers here, and you've got to make it all the way up into the finish line, and then I guess off the other end, maybe? Maybe you should stop about right there. But yeah, Bob's going to take on this challenge. Now, you have to put this uh, little course into God mode. I'm assuming it falls apart if you don't. Which, we might try it both ways, depending on how well this goes. So, yeah, the group of Bobs, they've uh, they've gone away from where the uh, stunt show arenas were, or the little tracks with the, uh, the jumps on them, and they're ready to watch this next event take place. So, let's go ahead and try this. I, I think I can do this. Let's go ahead and turn off our parking brake. Alright. So, this is going to be like a, a rock-crawling challenge here so oh this thing's got a really cool suspension on it actually look at the uh look how low the tire pressures are you can see the tires actually deforming that's cool okay so let's go uh, 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 uh. <laughs> well bob made it up oh, okay here we go oh dude this is kind of cool actually hold on hold on hold the phone bob can do this bob is an expert driver pilot stunt man oh yes all right, that was cool. All right, let's go up this. Whoa! No, 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 no! Get some grip! Get some grip! We're slowly doing it. We're slowly doing it, peg by peg. Come on! If I can just get those top tire top tires to grip. Come on! Grip! Grip! Got it! Oh, oh! How do we do this next section? Uh, let's go like this. There we go. Am I supposed to have the car in uh, God mode? I would think not. Oh, oh, oh! Yes! No! Yes! Okay, here we go. Let's try to grip up to the top. Dude, this is so cool! Uh-oh, oh, wait, how do we do this? Um, do I, I kind of feel like I need to have one of the tires on the left or the right side. 
Uh, see if we can try to skim this over. Come on. Come on, buddy. If I can get you to get me some grip. Get me some grip. Come on. Get those little get those little strips right there. There we go. Oh, uh oh, no, no, no. Okay. There we go. Dude, this is really cool. I, I'm surprised I haven't played with this before. Uh, get over that, and then we're gonna hop. Oh, don't high center. There we no, don't flip. <gasps> Woo! Bob is an expert rock crawler. All right, here comes the last bit of the challenge. Let's go ahead. Oh, this is gonna be tough. This is a uh, probably one of the steepest inclines, and it's got those two little pieces sideways. I picture being able to. Uh, I think you can get stuck on those. Huh? Let's just go ahead. Let me get that grip. Get the grip down. Don't want to get stuck on those pieces. No, no. Yeah. Yeah, Bob has conquered the rock crawling challenge. Wow, that was... Oh, no. No, no, Bob's too heavy here. Oh, uh, oh, uh, oh, oh. Oh, hold on. Uh, we're, we're tipping it over. No, no, no. <laughs> I'm going to count that as a win. That was... That was actually really fun to do. I kind of want to see another one of those. Maybe a bigger one. That was so awesome. I mean, look at that. You know, I'm kind of curious. What's that like without God mode? Oh, no, no. Oops. Uh, hold on. I'm just going to we're gonna park over here. Uh, we're going to rock crawl over a couple of the bobs. We're going to do that one more time. And I'm going to see what happens when that thing is not in God mode. Okay, so we had a bit of an accident. Uh, it's okay. The bobs are they're still in good spirits. Okay, so this is no longer in God mode. So let's hop up on this. Let's see what happens here. There we go. Then, oh, oh. <laughs> okay. Yeah, that's uh, that's what happens. All right, what happens when we try to go up the ramp here? Oh, 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 oh. this made this way worse. Okay, I, I know why it needs to be in God mode now. Actually, this makes the, actually this makes this a lot easier. This is how Bob should have done it in the first place. I'm um, gonna just get over that. Oh, 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 oh. Nope, nope, we're still good. Still good. We're gonna get through that finish line. Uh-oh. Oh, there we go. Uh-oh. Oh, oh, we got a tire stuck. Oh, I think, I think this is, uh, this is over with. Dang it. Huh. Well, that's actually, that was a pretty good event. That one went uh, a lot better than I pictured it going, but... Yeah, we got a couple more things planned here. We're gonna clean up this little bit of a mess, and we will move on to the next thing. You know, this stunt show is a little too tame for Bob. Bob wants to step it up, so we have moved into the city, and we've got this awesome little plane by Bat Duck. Now, you're probably going to ask yourself, well, what's going to make this more extreme? Well, Bob's going to have to go up the street, go through all of these loops, as I'm dropping this skyscraper from the sky. So, my hope is that I can time this out, which I really doubt I'm going to be able to. I don't know how high to drop the skyscraper. From the sky so we're gonna do that we're gonna fly through and we're gonna try to make it under the skyscraper <laughs> oh this sounds ridiculous but this is a good idea uh, this is a very good idea I actually got this idea from the comments uh, the comments section so yeah uh, let's try this I'm gonna need to hop out I need to hop into the skyscraper which is in God mode right now and I need to turn that off okay God mode is off Alright, so let's get a bit of an idea as to how high up can we drop a skyscraper? And how accurate is it? It's not very accurate, is it? Okay, we are on this street here, so if I were to drop it, it would need to be, like, here. Okay? What does this look like from down here? Oh, that is a lot faster than I thought it would be. Oh, dear. Oh. Oh. That wasn't as big of an impact as I thought it would be. Okay, so the skyscraper is pretty fast. We're gonna need <laughs> we're gonna need to go really high up in the air for this. So uh, let's try to get this as direct as possible. Uh, let's see, let's make an arrow up here. All right, so let's go basically into outer space here. Probably gonna need to go forward. There we go. And yeah, we're gonna do a little test run here. We're gonna drop it from up here. There we go. Hop out. Let's go ahead and get into the camera. Get into the plane. Plane's ready to go. Let's go ahead and get this moving. Parking brakes on. Plane's going in reverse now. Because why not? There we go. Come on. Plane, I need you to lift. 
Lift. Lift. I don't see the sky. Oh, there it is! Wait, it just bounced right back. What the heck is happening? Oh, we might still be able to make it. No, we're not going to be able to make it. Okay, you know what? I would have been not so close. Uh, maybe I need to start closer. That skyscraper really bounced. This is going to take a little bit of practice here, folks. Actually, it's probably going to take a lot of practice. So the skyscraper's been doing some weird little falling back thing uh, when I drop it from the sky. So I dropped it more towards the center of the city with hopes that this is going to work a little bit better. So... There we go, waiting for a skyscraper to randomly- Oh, that would have been a perfect hit! Okay, so I know where to drop it now. I know where to drop the skyscraper. Uh, I would say it's a timing discrepancy of about five seconds there. That thing falls really fast, though. I was hoping for a nice little slow-mo epic thing. Uh, no, that- where did it go? Oh, it's in the Sarlacc pit. Okay. Alright, we're getting up in the air once again. Oh, boy. Alright, I feel like this is going to eventually work. This is all going to be about timing, folks. All going to be about... <laughs> okay, we're getting closer. We're getting close. Oh, we almost went... Oh, no! <laughs> this is getting good. This is getting good. I feel like this is going to work. Uh, our timing's getting better. Our aim's still a little off. But other than that, I'm pretty proud of this. Okay, here we go. We got another attempt happening now. And, oh, okay, come on. There we go. All right, going through the loops real nice and easy. Looking out for a potential dropping skyscraper. Uh, oh! <laughs> that scared me. <laughs> I thought we outran it that time. I think I know about where we can drop this. If I could just clear it, either that or... I don't know if it's going to get much closer than that. That was amazing. Oh, that's great. I wish we could do this with an even bigger building, but I don't think that's possible. That was a good attempt. That was a really good... The timing was like within a second. If I could have had maybe a second or two more, I think I would have been under that or it would have landed on top of me. That is amazing. Alright, here we go. We are in the air, going through the loop. 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 Where's the building? Where's the building at? Where's the... Did I just see a shadow form? Oh, no! No! Oh, this is the hardest thing to time out. I don't think it's going to get much closer than that. Yeah, by the time... If you do pass under the building, you're not going to see it. You might see the shadow of it. The timing would be within a split second. Oh, that's amazing, though. I've never thought to actually drop a skyscraper from the sky and try to pass under it with a plane. I would say that's a, a pretty extreme uh, old stunt there. Even though it didn't go out 100% according to plan, that is still pretty epic. And it's actually, it's really frightening looking out for a skyscraper. <laughs> All right, I think it's time to move on to the next thing. All right, so we're going to cap off this stunt show with a bit of a bang. So, I've got three, count it, three office buildings. And when this train passes by, I'm going to set all three of these on the track. So, it's 10,000 plus bricks that are about to get taken out by the city train. So, there goes the city train. All right, time to start setting this up. This is going to be a little painful to do. There we go. Let's go one here. Okay, don't completely blow up on me or tip over. Oh, up oh, on repair, repair, okay. We repaired, are we on the tracks? No, we're not on the tracks. Oh, thankfully that city train takes a while to get across, so let's go here. Okay, that one's probably okay. No, it's not. No, it's dipping. Okay, try this again. All right, one building's down. Two buildings are down. Grab the third one. Third building is in place. Oh boy, the frames are about to get real. Alright, so we have three buildings on the skyscrapers. No, don't don't tip over for the, the train gets here. Here we go. Slow this down. Oh boy, this is gonna be bad. 
Uh, even the train's honking the horn like, what are you doing? What are you doing? All right, here we go. Oh, choo-choo. <laughs> this is gonna be like dominoes. Is it gonna hit the other building? Oh, this is bad. This is bad. This is actually awesome. <laughs> Right, here comes the second, <laughs> second building. <laughs> Why have I never attempted this before? All right, here comes the third building. Oh boy, that train, it's just unstoppable. You can't do anything about it. All right, third building, boom. You can put infinite buildings there and there's no way that the train doesn't stop it. That is glorious looking. There we go, full speed. Wow. Very impressive. Very impressive. That is ridiculous. And we have, like, not very good frame rate right now. You know, these are all landing... These are all laying across the tracks, basically. Uh, we're gonna let the train come by one more time and wrap this up. Alright, so I hope you guys enjoyed this episode of Brick Rigs. If you have any ideas for new episodes or any creations you want to show me, you can just comment down below. Here comes the train. It's going to take the buildings. Wait, what? Wait, what? What is going on? Okay, that is way more epic. Wait, you can launch buildings with the train. That was awesome! Uh, I'm not really sure what's happening anymore. But yeah, if you guys have any more suggestions for Brick Rigs episodes, comment below. I look forward to seeing all the comments. You guys are definitely awesome with your support on the Brick Rigs series. So yeah, we'll have more videos coming up very soon, and we will see you guys next time. Thank you.